So as it relates to land matters, where we've revamped the land administration system in the state, and the state looks very different now. The state capital is uh, a respectable state capital. Urban renewal is going on. We've established uh, collaboration with UN Habitat on structure plans of nine cities. We're doing uh, urban renewal in nine cities. And the overall environment is looking more uh, honorable now. And uh, by virtue of the mandate that the good people of Oshun has given to Ogbeni Ralph Arik Beshola only last Saturday, uh, we're poised for greatness in the state of Oshun. And God being our helper, uh, the right things will be done. So um, the good people of Oshun are with us and uh, we're forging ahead. Now, uh, it needs total readjustment. Uh, you've got the federal government bearing down on sub-national governments, wanting to uh, embark on a do-or-die uh, campaign as well as politicking, and even using the instrumentality of governance to try to uh, uh, to to to, sw to sway uh, the votes or in in their direction. We stood tall, and I want to congratulate uh, all the good people of Oshun uh, by not allowing the shenanigans of Ekiti to occur. Even at the dying moment, uh, the early hours of Sunday morning, we had understood that they were trying to force INEC to announce the opposition candidate and damn the consequences. But uh, the will of God prevailed and Ogbeni was returned. And that's what, I mean, 60,000 uh, security agents, per agency personnel were sent uh, to Oshun uh, for an election. If that's, and we have a national uh, election coming, general election coming up in February, what will happen? We don't have 2.16 million uh, men to deploy uh, across the country. So, and then uh, the intimidation, the harassment, we had uh, security agencies firing in broad daylight with masks trying to cow our people, but uh, they, were, they were able to harass and intimidate the people in uh, Ekiti. But Oshun people stood tall. When they were firing in broad daylight, we came out with our brooms and we were screaming and yelling, APC, APC, change federal. And by the grace of God, by February next year, we will take over government. But uh, by the grace of God, God will give one the enablement to keep the flag flying. I'm in a position right now where uh, one has been called to serve and uh, by the grace of God we'll do justice to service. We have to serve the people. Governance is about service. It's not about self-aggrandizement. And so, uh, well, by the grace of God, God will help one out to, uh, to serve. And posterity will judge us positively that at least in this time and space that we have created something pretty special under the leadership of Agwen Ralph and Okay. PC, change. Change, federal. Change, Jonathan. Yeah.